Hello guys, my name is Ancient Starcraft, and I'm here with a one versus one against two rival schools. Those schools being Rutgers University, whoa mouse, stay. Rutgers University versus Princeton University. Our Princeton University's representative for our first game is going to be Lightning, spawning as the Blue Zerg, spawning at the top, uh, right top center position I really don't know how to describe this area but right here just look at the minimap and we have our Rutgers University representative yeah our light pink I guess uh, pink purple purple pink I think it's more pink let me know in the comments below he is going to Rutger representing Rutgers University and he is going to spawn at the lower left center corner ish side now the map is going to be MLG's version of Antigua Shipyard and how I know that is because of these gold minerals. Now, the GSO, which is a premier uh, StarCraft 2 league of the world, pretty much, hosted by uh, Koreans in Korea, uh, does not have this rich mineral field. But in this map, the MLG version, it does. And I believe my memory is serving me right, but if it's not, please comment below and just troll me. Troll me, uh, whatever, say, oh, you saw, you should have researched before I cast this game, blah, 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 blah. And just, as long as you correct me, I'll allow you to troll. Troll, lo, 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 Alright, we see, we do see a gas before pool opening. This was a 14 gas, I believe. And he's going to have pretty much enough gas. Um, sorry, I'm going through puberty at, uh, 22, apparently. Uh, he's going to get uh, that early gas just so that he has up to a hundred and be able to uh, get the metabolic boost. Now, Lightning is going for a more economic style, going for a hatch first. Now, from just coming in and spy, uh, the spotting the uh, the base, he that was actually pretty busy because there's a lot of early aggressive builds without the extractor. Now all the uh, drones do get pulled from this extractor after reaching the 100. This uh, metabolic boost is going to re get research and we see six zerglings actually going out. Yeah, going for really, really big aggressive play. Uh, the, this drone is just going to go home and be like, hey guys, oh my god, there's like six lings on the way, man. We got to prepare our defenses. And those defense answer is to drop the spawning pool, which just pops gas is just going to get start mining so he won't have enough gas for metabolic boost for a long time but he's going to respond by building two uh, six links of his own, own and a queen now we just see these six zerglings just camping out this Zalmao watchtower now that it's, uh, it's uh, two friends just a little bit distant behind it's going to start uh, marching up into the space this natural early natural of lightning now lightning is going to be like up, oh, no, and both players are not quite willing to engage this right now. Uh, lightning wants to engage now just because he does have two more, but yeah, also has two more. So both players are about equal. Actually, uh, yeah, has more, but we do have a banging set going down for blue, and uh, yeah, is actually going to expand behind it. Mining is going on, but I don't see yeah being able to do too too much. He does smack a drone down. Uh, speed just finishing up for our pink Zerg player. And this one queen has to be careful just because if it gets a complete surround, this queen may die, and that's actually a small victory in itself. Uh, in the early game, it is said that the cost of larva, well, lar larva expenditure is more quote unquote expensive than you spent, than you spending the money on lanes or something like that. It was just like, um, I'm sorry, I messed that up. Uh, larva is more, it's a lot more important in the early game than exactly like the army count or something like that. I don't know. It was some, uh, I read that on, uh, Spanish Rose Ice Fisher build, and as he will explain why he does his, uh, gasless build up to, like, gasless up to 40 build. And, uh, yeah, you guys should check it out on TeamLiquid.net. And Spanish Rose is one of my most favorite Zerg players, and we want to see some sort of banglings versus banglings, two banglings picking up two banglings, I'm assuming. Ooh, explosions everywhere. Banglings chasing banglings, and we do see a spine crawler going down. If Yam wants to make something happen, he has to make something happen 
before that spy crawler goes down because spy crawler in addition to queen with links are going to be more than be able to hold this up 12 links on the way for blue and 18 links uh, I, I'm sorry 14 links uh, on the way from yeah if you look at unit county station we have 35 links for yeah and 25 links now because it's a massive bangling head very nice 23 links to 16 links 4 banglings to 5 no, I, I heard some bangling explosions look at our units kill count he has killed yeah, Lightning has killed a lot more units than uh, Yeah has, and this is becoming not a good engagement from Yeah. Yeah is going to be in a very tight spot because he does he does have this one spike crawler in the door of his main. I mean his natural, which leads to his main. And I really don't think Yeah should be too too aggressive. Another spike crawler going down, but Yeah not really to relent. He wants to do some damage with this push. Bailing very nice uh, being on the move command. But three banglings or three banglings. Okay, I guess I'll buy it. That's an even trade. These Zerglings are going to eat up that lone Zergling. Try to run in here. Try to do something. This one. Oh my god, he might get. Oh, okay, so he is going to use two Zerglings. Two slightly bangling out. He's going to say two link sacrifice is better than all of these. Now, once he sees that this spine crawler has popped, he, I'm, I really, really don't think he is going to actually push this attack any further. This lone Zergling is going to go up here. Sees that there are two spy crawlers, and then the reaction should be to go back. Now, the second base has been up for a little bit, uh, for yeah, but second base has been up and mining for a longer time for lightning. Supply is going to favor lightning right now by eight. Excuse me, I try to muffle a burp. I hope my burp didn't come out. Ooh. Let's see, e Roach Warren is going to go down. Or, yeah, but yeah already has ro a roach horn and has a, one roach. How many roaches does he have? He does have a single roach, and he's gonna move out with a uh, with a small strike force. Trying to do, probably want to do some uh, scouting here. All right, if you look at the the lightning vision, if you look at the lightning vision. He just he knows that there is a hatchery going down right now uh... yeah it's going to actually spot this. there are two uh... banglings here right now going to be able to... oh wow there is a small uh, space there is a... this wall is not zergling proof there is a small space three roaches are here though with banglings this zergling uh... this small zergling roach uh... is going to be able to push this away and Metabolic boost is about to finish for lightning. If you look at our unit counting station again, it's 38 drones to 34 drones, which means lightning is going to be slightly ahead in terms of economy. Now, in terms of units killed, yes, he lost one worker from yeah, but he's killed 42 units from of yes. So we shall see how yeah will recover. Uh, yeah, it's just. A, Slightly lower in supply, uh, 68 to 59, but Lightning is a little bit supply blocked. Which is going to give him a little bit of chance to uh, catch up a little bit here. Uh, yeah, he's actually throwing down an Evo Chamber, but Evo Chamber already done and upgrading me uh, missile attacks. Roaches are so good against the wings. And we see three spine crawlers actually going down. Uh, let's see. It says there's a yes unit here somewhere. Right here somewhere, actually. I, I don't know if that's actually a glitch or what, but you guys, if you guys see that minima, there's something right here that I'm not seeing. Maybe, maybe I'm just uh, freaking out because this is definitely pink. Unless those are marking the uh, indestructible. This uh, neutral, yeah. Never mind. The colors for the units of light pink are actually the same color for the neutral uh, supply depots. <laughs> now, this roach is going. This little roach hit team is going to try to go out and do something, but these overlords are going to be able to see if that move. You just see a small contingent of Zerglings controlling the zone now, watchtower, which will 
we must give vision around here, like the outskirts of the Rams. Now we see a third expansion going down. Lightning flying his Overlord here, and I think it's Overlord. He did upgrade Overlord speed very peculiarly. Uh, Overlord drop actually not down, actually. And we see oh, oh, oh a decent sized Roach army. More and with more Roaches reinforcing. 16 lanes being built right now, and we want to see him march. March ever, ever so slowly because Roach Speed actually is not done yet. He did a plus one timing push with this, and he's gonna be able to do quite a bit of damage. He's gonna walk up here to the third, and yeah, is actually not in a position to defend this. Yeah, actually not reacting. Will yeah be able to get the cancel off this hatchery in time? No, he does not actually. Just a waste of 300 minerals there, and he, and Lightning's gotta feel confident. He's gotta charge in here. Three spine colors are gonna go to work. Spine Colors doing 30 damage against uh, armored units as opposed to 25. Uh, Lightning's uh, concave and positioning is actually really good. It's gonna be able to take out all those Spine Colors. It's gonna be able to push this unit back. He should really, yeah, should really transfer these drones out. Yeah, these drones are surely going to get killed, and Lightning, and, and yeah, cannot afford that. Yeah, actually, start to stall the roaches while these eight roaches are actually in production. These roaches doing what they can to hold this push up. Will he be able to do it? He does have, uh, Lightning does have more reinforcements streaming down if you look at the mini mini map. And yeah, it's actually going to be able to hold this push up. Drone's actually gonna come down. Let's get our, uh, units killed. Lost hat. Lightning has killed 9 workers as opposed to yes 1 and killed 83, 87 units as opposed to 73. Now, Unit kill minerals. Uh, let's look at a resources lots tab here. Which, uh, if we look at this resources, it's going to just a little bit higher from yeah. And we just see actually two hatcheries going down from lightning. Where is it? Uh, we see a macro hatch and this hatch expanding to the third. Third being rebuilt by yeah. And yeah, has those mutalisk. He's going for that uh, mutaling bling play. As opposed to what is Lightning doing? He's gonna do Roach Hydra. A lot of Hydra already on the field right now. Blue Spine Upgrade actually isn't down. Two more mutas coming in. Let's look at our unit. Uh, these are actually three, four mutas. Actually, try to poke in here, try to do a little damage, but he's not gonna be able to. With very, very nice positioning of these four crawlers. And combined combination of sport crawler and mutil uh, and hydralisk and queen and these mutalists are just gonna be like all right, I'm just gonna go away. There are roaches coming from here right now, uh, and these roaches are actually going. I believe it's going to try to attack the third. Let's see if uh, yeah can do some damage here. Yeah, actually, um, not engaging with those units. Yeah. Doing a little micro, trying to have all of them attack the base. He is focused on this hatchery right now. Will uh, Lightning be able to stop it? And I think Lightning will be able to with a lot of Roach, uh, Roach Hydra. 152 supply to 101. Lightning is actually really behind. I mean, whoa, really ahead. Yeah, it's actually behind by 50, about 50 supply. Uh, yeah, really, really needs to, to make something happen here. And I feel that this base is slightly oversaturated. You actually don't want um, drones to actually bounce at all, which um, we're seeing that actually come down now on this base. We see a huge, oh my god, this is a huge push coming from lightning, but there's a lot of mutilants on the field right now. They're going to be able to take out a decent bit of um, roaches. Hydra is so, so slow off tree, but they do have the two uh, melee attack upgrade. And yeah, getting such a bigger hooks, he's going to stick on with this Ling Bling Muta play. And does he have any upgrades? He's just about to finish melee attacks level 1. But we don't see any possibility of a Hive, uh, hive tech just yet. Uh, I don't. I actually wouldn't feel comfortable with that either with this many units. Uh, Lightning just a little bit supply block, these mutilists picking up uh, overlords here and there. But still, the su supply discrepancy is so huge at the moment. 
And yeah, looking forward to do another push. Now we just see a double expand just finishing up for yeah, but he's yes yeah, not gonna be able to transfer the drones at all right now. Now he does have a lot of bandits morphing in right now. Um yeah, it's actually uh lightning's going to try to push in here and all these bandits are actually going to get decent hits. Will these families be able to land hits? I don't know. Yeah, they are more finished. Guys, actually take out you know, a lot of decent damage. Now, yeah, it actually take, managed to take out pretty much all the Hydras, which means all these Mutalists is going to go to town. But he's going to lose his third again. He lost his third for the second time. And these uh, Roaches are going to go down. Roach, Roaches progress into the natural. has been halted by these Zerglings. Just so that these mutilists can try to attack. More Zerglings going out, trying to stall this push from the roaches, and these roaches are eventually gonna get taken out. Now the supply is going to even up a little bit, but lightning still has is ahead by about 15. Now ha another another lair tag is actually gonna go down from here. I'm not sure why, and he actually does wind up canceling. That might have been a misclick. Uh, yeah, it's going to just poke in here, try to do some damage at the third base, but he's going to see that there are indeed spore crawlers. This spore crawler is just turning around and saying, I'm going to shoot you if you even try. These drones going to be, yep, we got some overwatch. So I'm gonna drone, do drone things, cause I'm a drone, and I'm gonna mine. Now this, uh, this right base, this uh, right corner base, uh, right bottom corner base, is not really doing anything. It has no function at the moment, and there are three drones just mining peacefully, happily, on this uh, left top center. Uh, but these bases are really open. Yeah, it doesn't quite have the army to uh, to cover all of these. He has 24 lay, 28 legs, and seven mutalisks. And yeah, he should at least have two spines, I think, per base, just so that it will delay any push or um, attack that uh, lightning might do to uh, to uh, try to prevent these. And we do see a lot of drones transferring over now. You know, it's gotta come in here, tr see that there's a small ball, and takes out a couple of roaches here and there, but ultimately it's going to run away. Now, oh wow, this mineral patch didn't get mined out. Troll alone, just kidding. Same thing for here. Ha 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 ha. Okay, so we see these mutos just trying to do what it can to harass this uh, unit army in the middle. Now, observing the unit count is 10 mutos against 13 hydralists. Hydra is probably going to win that one because of their upgrade as well. Um, ground army wise, the 10 roaches will more than take on 20, oh, okay, maybe not 20, I'm not quite sure, I'm pretty sure it could though with the plus 2 attack. Let's go back to our production tab right here, 14 wings on the way with 2 hydras and a drone. Little harassment going down here, I actually killed off a lot of drones, let's see. He had managed to kill about 8 more drones since this last time, but there's a 34, 30 to 34 drone lead. And that is because he is attacking this base. These Zerglings are going to be able to take out all these drones. Will he be able to take out this hatchery? Probably not, but there's actually a decent bit of units. Now, this is what I'm saying. If he had one or two spine crawlers, he might have been able to delay that just a little bit enough to save a little bit of drones. These uh, couple of hydras are going to be uh, eliminated. And this one just being uh, mis uh, rallied and probably going to get taken out. But this Roach Hydra mix is going to come in here and be like, I will avenge the and push his army back. Now he's got more 12 banglings at the center of the map with these um, let's see how many mutas does he have? He has 16 mutas so he's going to try to do some damage with these mutas. He's going to try to get up here do something but let's see what happens. He's still just flying around we see an infestation pit actually about to it's actually going down right now. I think he's going to transition to something maybe roach infester? With a Roach Hydra Infestor, that's a very gas heavy army. But, with this Ling Bling Muta, Infestors are going to be very good. Upgrade pathogen glands, and you guys gotta be able to at least have a single fungal. He loses one, two, three. Three Mutalins, that is not what he wants to do. And the Banglings against Banglings. Banglings should have been actually being, I think, 
a little bit better micro would definitely have been meaning a little bit better micro from yeah would have meant is what I meant to say a little better micro would have been probably have to take a lot more hydras of lightning which means this will look actually a little bit different and lightning might have been a little bit behind in terms of supply now this might this base is actually not going to get mined out uh, this base has a single drone what is the drone count right now let's check 16 drones to 33 I'm actually scared to look at the income tab income tab is actually not that bad no, did I misread that? No, there's 33 drones or 16 drones, and he's only slightly ahead. What? What? What's all those drones doing? Huh. I'm confused. But anyway, it's probably because uh, yeah, it's mining from this base. It's a little bit from this base, so I guess one mining base versus two does make uh, the difference in evening out. Now here, this is what I was actually expecting to see. Now this mutant is going to snipe an overload here too, which is going to get just get a little bit annoying. But nothing that uh, Lightning won't be able to uh, manage. Uh, yeah, it's got to poke up here, it's going to snipe that Hydralisk. Sorry. Did that mean for it to didn't mean it to be plural. And yeah, yeah is actually, I'm not sure what yeah can do. He's actually a little bit behind in supply once more. Let's look at the production tab. He has 10 more lanes on the way to just finish. And I'm trying to think of a way that Yeah could uh, come back. Yeah could actually just keep doing this minor harassment to keep Lightning in the base. Drone comp heavily on these bases. Now this base, nor this base, has a queen. So they, this base doesn't actually have a queen. How Does he have a queen? He only has one queen. Let's look at a unit tab just to make sure. Yeah, he has one queen against Lightning's two queens, and he's actually going to be behind on the larva count. I wish there was a, ta uh, a tab in ZVZ to, or any Zerg matches so that you can see how much larva you exactly have. Yeah, he's actually going to come in here trying to do a lot of damage, but there are infestors here with, the fu um, with fungal growth, two fungal growth, beautifully being placed, and this army is actually going to go down. GG is called. And it is right now 1-0 from Princeton University. I hope you enjoyed this cast for those uh, people at the Rutgers uh, side who uh, allowed me and showed me where the replays are. I thank you. Again, so I'm going to uh, give a quick shout out to Eric the Red and everyone else from the Rutgers StarCraft 2 team. Uh, please uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel as um, obviously this is a learning process for me as well. And yeah, I'll see you guys at game number two.